All right, in this tutorial, I'm gonna walk you through how to use Dewey's new Instagram feature. So in this uh, walkthrough, we're going to use Dewey to now pull in all of your Instagram saved posts. Uh, now, Instagram started their saved posts feature back in 2016. So that means that we're coming up on probably a decade of saved posts for most of you, um, where it's probably just been locked away inside of Instagram's save post feature, never to be looked at again. So today we're gonna to pull them out and I'm gonna walk you through how to do that with Dewey. So the first thing that you wanna do is make sure that you have the newest version of the Chrome extension for Dewey installed on your browser, on your desktop, okay? I'm gonna assume that you have that done. If you do, you know that you'll have it done because if you go to settings and then go to integrations, you'll now see automatically sync Instagram saved bookmarks and this will be enabled by default, okay? If you can choose to disable it, but we will enable it by default if you have the new Chrome extension. So we're gonna go into Instagram and I'm gonna just start saving a few different posts, okay? Uh, let's save that, great. And if I head over to my profile, I click on saved and now I see all of my posts. Now I can click grab save post just to be safe, but Dewey's gonna do it anyway. Now, the next thing I'm gonna show you, once this all ingests, I'll prove to you that it's pulled into Dewey, is we're then gonna create collections, which are Instagram's version of folders for saved posts. And I'm gonna show you how Dewey syncs those collections or those folders into the Dewey dashboard so that you don't have to recreate folders over again. And we do all of the deduping so that everything goes to its proper place. But first, let's just make sure that these um, Instagram posts came in to Dewey. I'll refresh the page. And you'll notice to do this really quickly, I have here on the side, uh, one of the filters is by source. So I can just click Instagram and I see that all of my new Instagram posts are showing up in here. Now, let's go ahead and create a collection back in Instagram. I'm gonna name this one IG and it's gonna ask me to add some of that content from my saved into this new collection. So we'll just add a few into it click done and we now see that there's this collection called IG. I'll click grab save posts again just to be sure this does happen automatically but for the sake of this tutorial I'm just going to walk you through um, all of these steps and when I go back refresh the page you will now see that I have a folder on the left hand side that says IG and when I click into it it's all of those posts from my Instagram collection called IG. Um, when I go back into unsorted, okay, and I just click on Instagram, I will then see all of my other Instagram saved posts that don't belong to a collection or to a folder inside of Dewey. And that's pretty much it. It's straightforward. You can bookmark or save posts from your Instagram mobile. And then uh, Dewey will, once you're back on your browser, we will automatically look for any new saved posts that you saved when you were on your uh, mobile device uh, and pull them into Dewey for you automatically, as long as you have left that enabled in these settings. And if you remember, you just go to settings, integrations, and just leave this as enabled. Do not click disable unless you want to do that. So that's it. Enjoy.